Contrary to what we might expect, our research here at the University of Oxford indicates that on balance, having access and using the internet might be much more of a positive thing than popular media narratives would have you think. We analyzed data for more than 2.4 million people across the last 16 years, and we wanted to ask directly, is the internet good for us? Is having a smartphone positively related to well-being? And how might technology and its impact on mental health and well-being be different in different parts of the world? We looked at eight different types of well-being across 168 countries and three types of technology engagement uh, with the internet. And looking at the data all of these different ways, more than 33,000 different analyses, we found that on balance, the associations are positive. In 85% of the cases, these analyses showed a positive link, a positive correlation between access and use of the technologies and mental health and well-being. In about 15% of cases, it looked like a wash. The analyses weren't statistically significant in either the positive or negative directions. In half of 1% of cases, we found something concerning and potentially quite interesting. We found a negative correlation between technology engagement and well-being. The way that we study the internet isn't just something that's limited to Europe and North America. Young people use the internet all around the world, and future research should focus like this on those populations and how they use technology and how they, they fit technology into their lives for good or for ill.